so I started working with Lorenzo in 2000, uh, beginning of 2013, and we started uh, uh, work on the soil. That maybe Lorenzo, would you like to explain what? We yeah, thank you. Now mm. uh, we are using a lot of mulch with our hay we produce in the farm, okay. and we are mulching. As you can see underneath the plant. and keeps moisture, you see, for example. Yeah. And organic matter, and any biology. So it's improving biological quality of the soil. This is pretty important. And um, so that we, we are using every two years, we do, we do mulching. And in between rows we do almost nothing, just we are not coming with mechanical tools in order to keep soft the soil. Uh, it's like a carpet, that's very important. And we put as well... It's important because if you compact then you are killing the life underneath. So we want mm -hmm. to have a lot of life in the soil. As we are in a very dry region, we, at, at the top of the vineyard, we put always mulch as well. And you see how it's, it's like a reservoir, so it's keeping the water, water and organic, so we do not lose nothing. All the rainfall is here. It's not going in the river. So when when you come here, maybe in a very hot season, like say you come here in July, and it's amazing, maybe it hasn't rained for a month, and you lift the mulching, you can still feel humidity. So this is our irrigation uh, system. <laughs> <laughs> Natural. Natural. Irrigation. No, it's not. Uh, sorry. No, I know. I'm <laughs> not, <laughs> no, it's very, it's try not to lose. Yeah, of the course. rainfall. That is I'm not that this is an example. We are doing experimentation as well. But you can do anywhere where the drought is, is a problem. So you have to cover the soil with mulch. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we do very very few practices. So what's important is the pruning. And, uh, and leave, uh, leave uh, bunches, go, uh, leave uh, branch to go anywhere, so we do not cut, never, we never do rognage or, as you see, so it's, it's like a tree. Yes, we grow in a, in a of course there is the row, but we grow the, the, the vine in a, the three dimensions, like a tree, like he was saying, so you see. How oh, is expanding? This is making life easier for the plant, okay? Because it has to survive in a very harsh environment. Very hot, very dry, heavy rains when it rains, very heavy wind. Uh, so uh, the more you let the plant uh, respect its natural shape, the more you are helping the physiology. No? If um can I? Mm? Uh, sure. If you are looking at the vineyard around, normally they are very narrow and all cut, but why? Just because to, to cross the mechanization, the mechanization has to go inside in between rows, but it's not good for uh, plant physiology. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, so practical course, tools. Yeah, you you can do this where you are not mechanizing, of course. Otherwise, you will, like you were saying, you need to have nails. And we do not cut any plant. And uh, sometimes, look, uh, this, this is done by wild folk. I mean, yeah, it's not us, it's the animals. It's not <laughs> us, it's the animals. <laughs> yeah. Because they are searching <laughs> for food. Because this mulching is attracting life. So, like little worms, you know, and little animals. So, they mm -hmm. are coming here to eat. <laughs> they lift and they find. Uh, yeah. 
Like I was saying, we attract animals. <laughs> <laughs> we feed them. <laughs> <laughs>